from your own life uh, w and your own experiences with filmmaking, what's something that you learned the hard way that you now correct or you now see through right mm -hmm. away, red flags, whatever, but it took you a little bit? I think that one of the most difficult things I've ever learned as a filmmaker, and this comes back to something we were talking about earlier, is that when you first start out, there's all these people you tend to work with, and you work with them on repeat, not because you are necessarily working with the best people, but because they're the people that are accessible to you. And what happens is over time, you start working with the same people over and over and over again. Some of them are good, some of them are bad, but eventually there comes a point where different talents and different skill sets are not helpful to broader goals. And what you have to do is you have to start letting some people go and replacing them with people that are better and that will make you better. And that is, I think, one of the hardest, most difficult things for you to swallow because it's not just professional, it's also personal. And I think on every project you work on, you pick up one person that you say, that person needs to come back to my next film, that person needs to come back to my next film. But if you get to the point where you start recycling every single person on every single project, your work instantly becomes stale because there are no new ideas being injected into it. So as a filmmaker, you've got to constantly be finding ways to reinventing yourself. And one of the first ways you do that is by finding fresh new faces and fresh new ideas.